boys and girls, it's me, Miss Sandra. I'm so happy to um, be here with you today. Pastor Ethan asked if I would read you a story today, and I said yes, and he chose my favorite story of all time, and I'll bet it's a story that you know, and I'll bet it's one of your favorites too. The story is in this book. It has read aloud Bible stories. What I'm going to read to you is a story that is in the New Testament of the Bible. So, it's going to be about Jesus. Here we go. <clears throat> Let's see. And the story begins like this. One day, God sent an angel to Mary's house. This must be the angel. And look, he's knocking on the door. That's Mary's front door, and he's knocking on the door. The angel had good news for Mary. And see, there's Mary. She answered the door, and I'll bet she was a little surprised when she saw an angel there. You know, an angel is a messenger, a messenger from God. This angel had a message for Mary. God's son is coming from heaven. You will be his mommy. Well, wasn't that good news? He will be a very, very special baby. Now here's Mary sitting on the floor. Look how well she's listening. And there's the angel and he's pointing to her and he's telling her, Mary, you're gonna be a mommy. Only this baby will be very, very, very special because it's God's son. You must name him Jesus, Mary said. All right, I will. And then look, the angel's leaving. And right here, it looks like she might be waving goodbye and telling him, thank you, goodbye. Now I wonder where he's going. Let's look right here. God's angel came to Joseph's house. He had good news for Joseph, too. Now look at Joseph's house here. Joseph was a carpenter. That means he made things from wood. He built things out of wood. Look, he's holding some wood right here. And he has some tools that he uses over here and over here. And there's the angel. And look at Joseph's face. Joseph, Joseph looks a little surprised, like, an angel has come to me? And he says he has good news. Let's see what happens. Mary will be a mommy, the angel said. Her baby will be God's son. He is coming to take away people's badness. Now, wasn't that good news? Now, look at Joseph. I bet he is so surprised and excited about this new baby. And the angel says that this baby is going to take away people's badness. Sometimes we call that sin. The wrong things that we do, we call sin. And so the angel says, the messenger says, this baby will take away people's badness. He's straight from God. You must name the baby Jesus. And Joseph said, all right, I will. Then one night, look at this picture, God's angel came to some men on a little hill. The men were taking care of their sheep, the angel said. I have good news for everybody. Now, first the angel had good news for Mary. Then the angel had good news for Joseph. Then the angel had good news for everybody. Hey, that's good news for us too. It's good news for everybody. Everybody a long time ago and everybody right now. He had good news. Now let's take a look at this picture and see what's going on. Well, the men are right here. These are the men. And these men are taking care of sheep. So they are called shepherds. The shepherds are watching over their sheep at night. And they're watching to be sure their sheep are safe, taking good care of them. Let's count the shepherds. Ready? One, 
two, three, four, five, six shepherds. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven shepherds. And how many angels? Just one, just one messenger. And how many sheep? I don't know, there's too many, we can't count them all. But they're looking up in the sky and all of a sudden there's an angel. And the angel said, God's son has come. He's come from heaven. He is a baby. He is sleeping in a manger. A manger is a box where donkeys eat their food. And look at the shepherd's face. Now the shepherd's faces are so surprised because they have known all along that God is going to send a special savior for them, a special person who is going to take away all their sins, who is going to give them peace and hope, and they've been waiting a long, 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 long time. And now here's an angel, and the angel says, he's here, God's son is here. And they are probably excited and surprised because now's the time. Now look at this picture. This is one I love. How many angels were here? Only one, but look right here. Oh, I can't even count them all, there's so many. Look at all those angels. Many angels were there. In one big voice they said all good things about God. After that, they went back to heaven and everything was quiet again. Everything was very, very quiet again. I just love to think about this picture. I love to think about these men at night taking care of their sheep, doing a good job and keeping them safe. And then a messenger from God comes, but not just one, many come. And they sing and share about God. I'll bet that was a great place to be that night. The men looked at each other and they said, what good news! Let's find the baby. Let's go right away. Let's go fast. And do you think they could find him? What do you think? Yes. And look at all these shepherds. They know that he is in a manger and they find the way to go. And now look what happens. Now, they found him. They found the baby Jesus. There was Mary, here's Mary right here, and there was Joseph, and there's Joseph right here, and there was the baby Jesus right here, sleeping in a manger. God's son from heaven, sleeping in the manger box, and they, all the shepherds, these shepherds, came to see for themselves. They wanted to see the good news. They wanted to see the baby Jesus. The men looked at the baby. They talked to Mary. They talked to Joseph. Then they went back to their sheep. Now they had good news to tell. Here you see Joseph, what Joseph and Mary and the little baby right here. He's here. Jesus Christ, the Lord, he's here. We heard the angels and we saw him. Look, they're telling all their friends, they're telling everyone they see, he's here. Jesus Christ, the Lord, he is here. They've been waiting, all of them, a very, very long time for him to come and then he came. Jesus Christ, the Lord. The end of the story. Now, this is a story we, that we usually read at um, Christmas time. We sing about Mary and Joseph and the little baby Jesus, and it's not Christmas time right now. But you know what? That is such a great story. We should be telling it all the time because that's the good news. The good news is that God the Son came down to earth as God the human. God the man, and he grew up to be a um, big, tall man. He grew up to teach people about God. He grew up to be our Savior, to forgive us of all our sins. 
to take all the badness we have inside of us out of us. And that's the good news. And you know, just like the um, shepherds were telling all of their friends, we ought to tell all our friends this good news too, because it's really, really special. Thank you for listening to the story today. I hope you have a very good, good um, rest of the day. And let's pray together. Are you ready? Here we go. Dear God, thank you for giving us this good news. Thank you for bringing your son, God the Son, all the way down to earth as God the little tiny human baby to grow up, to be a big man, to teach people about you, and to come as our Savior and Rescuer, and to take all our sins away. Now that is the good news. That's the best news ever. Thank you, God, for sharing that with us. Take care of these kids today and in the days to come. Bless them and keep them healthy and well. In your son's name we pray. Amen. Okay. Bye, y'all. See you another time.